So for the Ortolani, um, I like to do them when they're in lateral recumbency. Um, I start by putting the hand on the stifle, and the other hand, my, you know, my other hand, on the, kind of over the, over the sacrum. Um, I just kind of rest my thumb, where I kind of feel for the little depression between the greater trochanter and the ischial tuberosity. And I just rest my thumb there, and that's really just to kind of feel for any, any abnormal motion there. And to do the Ortolani, basically I'm pushing the stifle toward the hip, basically. I'm pushing this, pushing this limb proximally. And then I'm, and if, if the dog is dysplastic, that will actually cause the femoral head to subluxate out of the acetabulum. And then as I abduct the limb, it will clunk back in. Hopefully this doesn't happen, because I don't think this dog is supposed to have um, any dysplasia, but, so I push dorsally, and then I slowly abduct, and if, you know, if the, if the dog is plastic, this is about where you would feel sort of a clunk or a click, that this dog's hips feel, feel good, so. There you go, that's the order line.